Welcome to the Lockout Men Podcast Show, where we're going to park and politic tonight. That's what's up. I am your host, Lockout Men. And in today's topic, we're going to talk about Together Trucking LLC. Yes, sir, guys, this is a this is a trucking company. I'm not even sure if it's a trucking company, but I'm about to tell you what I experienced today. Now, you know, a lot of these dark calls from various quote unquote trucking companies that's looking for you to drive for them. You're not sure what kind of company they are. It could be a BS company or anything like that. It could be either a major company like KB. I wish they would freaking stop with the email. It's not an email, it's a text. And it's freaking annoying after you type in the word stop you feel me they keep saying yo we want to bring you on we want to give you thirteen hundred dollars it's a guarantee you don't have to worry about you don't have to worry about uh getting paid less money but thirteen hundred dollars and fifty thirteen hundred and fifty dollars a week that's guaranteed but is it though i mean i got about three hundred dollars worth of 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 taxes taken out so that's going to leave me with about maybe about nine and some nine eighty nine ninety nine or some shit like that i don't know i was told that lockout men you should stop chasing miles and i'm like huh that's not a bad idea I should go ahead and start chasing percentage. I mean, shit, you get a load that's paying about $3,000 and you get about 80% of the load. That's good money right there. You could do like three loads and you're done for the week other than chasing 3,000 miles in a 70 hour clock. Now, I guess that will probably be the next thing that I'm going to do is find a company that'll pay me percentage and that'll pay me percentage well, while on, not only getting benefits, because a lot of companies that's paying percentage want to hit you off with that 1099. Well, we're going to do 1099 because we don't want to be responsible for nothing. Now, I, I want to do percentage and benefits and a 401k i'm getting old y'all i'm getting old so let's talk about this company that this young lady was talking about today so driving down the way minding my own business i get a facebook message uh text and it's from this young lady named air adrian a Ariana, somebody pronounced this name in the in 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 the in the uh, comments below. If I'm pronouncing the name wrong, I think it's I think it's Ariana, Ari, Ariana, yeah, Ariana, Orphison, or Pearson, oh Pearson. I can't pronounce your name, lady, but. Don't get me wrong, my bad. All right, so she sent me a text this morning and the text read, it says, hello, how are, and I say hello. She says, how are you today? I said, I am good, thank you for responding as I may ask you how you come to know me and are you subscribed to the Lockout Men podcast show? She says, I subscribe to your channel. Where are you from? Now I'm already I'm, I'm already getting red flags. Like why you want to know where I'm from? I don't even know you. Not not too many people 
know me on Facebook, especially not too many people has my government name on Facebook. So if you happen to come across me on YouTube and I probably said my name many a times and then you just happen to type it up and then you see two names with the same name. One of them is my son's and the other one is me. You know, my son is with the W and me without the W. Then, you know, that's pretty much me. All right. I don't mind if you find me on Facebook because usually I use my Facebook as the LOM community group anyway. You know, I, I don't put no personal information on Facebook. I just use Facebook just to promote the Lockout Men podcast show. Welcome to the community. All right. So she says, I subscribe to your channel. Where are you from? I says, OK, send a screenshot. And welcome to the community. And wonder why I say uh, send a screenshot because people say that, yeah, I subscribe to your channel. They'll go subscribe and then they'll, they'll uncheck it, which is cool because, you know, sometimes YouTube don't get the name of the new subscribers on there. I wouldn't know. So send me a screenshot. Let me know that, you know, you subscribe and I'm, I'm good. I usually don't bring people in on the Facebook unless they subscribe to the YouTube anyway, because I feel like this. What is the point of bringing you in my circle if you're not going to engage with me in it? That's the point. What, 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 what I need to say is that, yo, yo, LaShawn got, got 500 friends. I barely know any of these people, <laughs> but if you are subscribed to the channel, then I can go back and equate the channel name. I mean, equate the name that's the name of the other name that's on Facebook. Welcome, welcome to the community. That's all. So she says uh, again. I subscribe to your channel and where you from? She said it twice. I says, thank you. I'm from Ohio. I said, you? She says, I'm from Easton. Easton. Easton, PA. I said, oh, okay, okay. So she says, how long you been trucking? I says, uh, I, I says, for a while now. She says, I own a trucking company. I have drivers. Together Trucking LLC, Eaton, PA. She says, do you drive? I says, okay. I, I said, okay. I have, I said, I have a talk show podcast that showcase drivers and trucking companies. I said, would you like to come on to promote your company? She says, you do a podcast? This is good for trucking, I can see. I say yes. She says, looks good. Do you drive? Now, let me, let me just, let me just hold up right there for a minute. Let me hold up right there for a minute. You're going to ask me if I drive, if you subscribed to my YouTube. So if you subscribe to my YouTube, from my YouTube, you could tell that I'm a driver. Why ask do I drive if you subscribe to my YouTube to see that I do the show from the truck and I also do content from the truck. So, yes. I drive, been driving six years deep, drive hard. Yes, I drive. So I did not want to be condescending, I guess, mean, rude, or whatever the case. I didn't want to be that. No, did not want to be that at all. No. So I says, yes. She says, how long have you been driving? I says, uh, I've been driving 
for, I said, I've been driving for a long time. You know, I, I've been driving. I've been driving for a long while. I says, how long have you been the trucking owner? She says she's been the trucking owner for five years. I says, that's cool. What do you have to offer? She says, I'm expending my business now. I use my grants to buy more trucks. Now I'm in need of more drivers. Okay, cool. So let's get the word out. Come more to the show. I can promote, help you promote your business. You can tell the drivers what you're looking for. You can also say, you know, what is your company is about. Yada, 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 yada. Simple, right? But no, not simple. Not simple at all. Instead, it gets a little bit more complicated. Let's continue. I says, cool. What do you have to offer? Uh, again, okay. She says, do you need a job? Look, y'all, if you're subscribed to my YouTube channel, you see that I'm already driving. Do I need a job? Maybe, maybe not. But you already see that I'm driving if you subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm just saying. Again, what do you have to offer? She came back and said this. I just ask a question and I expect an answer. Okay, I'm about to I'm, I'm about to hold up right there, right quick. Look at here. Look at here. I, I don't know you from Adam. I don't know you from Jack. I don't know your company from Squat. So yeah. Maybe you might expect an answer, but you technically haven't even answered my questions. So I expect an answer from you. You over here vetting, you, you dark teching, dark teching, teching? You're dark testing me about a company I'm not even familiar with. I ain't even hear, I did not even hear of of Together Trucking. What the hell is Together Trucking? Let's find out what the hell is Together Trucking is. This is what I found out of Together Trucking. T Together Trucking LLC. Do you operate this business? No. DOT number? Gotcha. Trucks and tractors? One. Two drivers? Registered DOT or US DOT, yes, and there's your MC number. Company information, you're located in Eaton, PA. No phone number, no cell phone number, and no fax number. Come on now. Let me let me repeat that. Let me let me repeat that one more time. No phone number, no cell phone number, and no fax. Bruh, how the hell are we going to get in contact with you? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Uh, no website, no email. Hazardous material, none. Carrier operations, interstate. Entity type, carrier. Service, vans, general freight, truck driver jobs available? No. Contact us regarding truck driver jobs? N-A. Trailer type? N-A. Driver type? N-A. This is Together Trucking LLC, y'all. No, you don't, you don't deserve no clap for that. So back to the conversation at hand, I said, and this is what I did. I, I, I broke it down for her. 
I, I broke it down for her. So let me, I, when I asked her at first, I says, again, what do you have to offer? I came back and I said, well, let me rephrase. What's the CPM? What, what, what is the CPM? What other what other pays to the driver like detention pay over I mean uh layover pay uh is there a sign on bonus do you have a sign on bonus you just said that you got another grant from you know to bring in more trucks so what incentive that you giving me to come on just saying how long is orientation or is there orientation um what else I said. I says, what's the average miles? What is the average miles? Like, how many miles did I would get uh, per week? Would I get 3,000? Would I get 33? Would I get 18? Would I get 25? What I'm going to get? I don't know. You tell me, which you haven't told me yet. What's your lanes? Regional, OTR, lower states? Are your, are your fleet managers drivers themselves? I mean, you're a small company. You're a small company with no information, I got to say. You have none, zero information that I can find on the web. Nothing. Okay? So is your, is your fleet managers driver themselves? Or are they just college kids coming out of college? Are the dispatch forced? Uh, how how do we how how do we receive our dispatches? Are are they phoned in, emailed in? Do we have a Qualcomm? I'm just saying, what type what type of load we'll be hauling? Is it reefer? Is it drive-in? Is it hazardous? Do do I need my um my hazmat? Do I do I need my hazmat? I don't know. Uh, what equipment? What equipment? What truck do you have? Do you got a Volvo? You got a Cascadia? You got a Peterbilt 550, 385, 1020? You got a W9KW, WT680? What kind of, what, what, what are we working with here? What, 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 what kind of trucks are we, are we working with? A Mac? Let me know what, what, what we're working with. Um, What's inside the truck? What do you got for the, what's inside the trucks? Is there a, re a refrigerator? Is there an APU inverter? I'm going to need an inverter. I got, I, I got a shoulder run from the truck. So I'm going to need power. I got lights, camera, action. <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, what ELD do you use? Or do we use ELDs? You know? What what I mean ELD man I mean uh mandate now so what what EL is it Sam Sarah is it Grand Manali I don't know what's your turnover rate or do you even have drivers or in the thing it says one one you only got one driver what would be the reason a driver would want to give your company a try. Now, mind you, this was back up at, at the conversation started at 840, I mean, 855. And we just continued through. Uh, two, two, 209, all right? 209. So she came back and says, she came back and says, cost per mile is $250. So I, I don't think she understood that. Is that $250 a day? $250 added? What? She says, if you achieve a task, you get bonuses of 20%. So again, I came back and I says, I said CPM is cent per mile. Question, $250. Oh, okay, fine. 
cool. She says, do you have a truck? I need three drivers for three trucks. Wait. If you need three drivers for three trucks, then why the hell you ask me if I have a truck? I, I don't get that. See, this, this is the misunderstanding that I'm not getting here, people. I'm not under I'm 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 not understanding the lingo here. Help me out. Somebody help me out in the comments below. The trucks, she said the trucks are insured. Do you have your own personal truck? Again, why ask me if I have a truck if you need three drivers for yours? Although I applied for a grant from the Relief Fund uh, USA to purchase extra trucks, I only have three. I had to request for a grant, which I received due to, due to I was eligible. They are now funded by the N. O A A. What the hell is the N O A A? Better yet, let's find out what is the N O A A. Uh National Oceanic Atmospheric Administration. Okay. I mean, that's what this says, y'all. National Oceanic Atmospheric Administration. I had the slightest idea what that has to do with damn trucking. You tell me. But that's what she says. She got the funding from NOAA. Okay. I asked for another relief fund and I was eligible. You can join the expansion. Mm. Okay. Together Trucking LLC, the sky is our starting point. Hmm. Again, where's the website? Together Trucking LLC. Where's where as far as the Facebook page, it's not much, it's not much on Facebook. It's not much on Facebook. I mean, Together Trucking LLC. Of course, I typed it in. And I only came up oh, only came up with this right here. Together Trucking, Together Trucking Company Snapshot. Okay, here we go. Together Trucking Carrier LLC. Operating status, not authorized. That's not a good look together. Trucking LLC, not a good look. Uh, together Trucking LLC, physical address is Hillside, New Jersey. I thought you was in PA. Hold on, wait. It says Eastern PA. Is that the same dude? Wait a minute. Hold on now. It's safe for you. You probably might be giving me the wrong number here. Here we go. Here we wait, but wait a minute. Hold on now. Together Trucking LLC. Two, 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 two together truckings. Okay, okay, okay. Authorized for property. Out of service date, none. Power units, one. Drivers, two. Excuse me. General freight, uh, vehicles, drivers. Not much information, man. Uh, it's, it's not it's not looking good together, trucking LLC. Not not looking good at all. 
I I, I don't together trucking the LLC. I I I don't know. I, I'm I'm sorry. I I'm sorry. I I don't think I can. I don't think I can mess with you. Uh, together trucking LLC is just not enough information out there about you. And this is what people have to do when they get uh, a dark call, a dark call, a dark text. Uh, I came back and I says, this is good to know, but was so little about the company. I don't know. I don't know. She says, we are on expansion. And then came back and asked, did you pass your CD fucking L? That, that right there pissed me off. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. So listen, uh, Ori, Ariana, Ar Ariana, or Fearson. O Pearson, O Pearson, Ari, if I'm pronouncing your name, if you are a subscriber of my channel, let me know if I'm pronouncing your name wrong and I will try to get it right next time. But let, let me, let me just tell you, all right, your company is suspect. All right. I'm, I'm just saying your company is suspect and I, I hate to say this, but you're suspect as well because you're asking me questions that you should already know. If you subscribe to my channel, like you said you did, then A, you'll know that I have my CDLs and B, you'll know that I'm driving and C, you know that I don't have my own truck. Okay. I'm just saying, uh, you know, uh, I, I'm, I'm, let me let, let me just say one more time. A, if you are a, a subscriber of the channel, A, you'll know that I'll have my CDLs. B, you know that I am driving. And C, you know that I don't have my own truck. So I am so sorry to tell you. I, if, if, if your company is legit, we just need to know a little bit more about you. I have no phone number, no address. Well, we got, I take that back. We got the address, but we don't have no fax number, no email, no Facebook, no YouTube, no nothing. I can't find nothing on you and the safer is saying that, yeah, you, you saying you got three? Safer says you only got one. I'm just saying. So let me, let me, let me, let me see if, hold on. Uh, let's see. Let's, let's view your profile. Let's see your profile right quick. Be, before we get on up out of here, y'all, we're going to see this young lady's profile. So, Ariana, 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 O. Pearson, O. Pearson, human resource executive with extensive global experience. Nice picture of a truck. But uh, that's not your truck. Temp Trans. Wanted class A drivers, temp trans, okay. Why are you, let me, let me ask you something, Ariana. I'm, I'm, I'm looking on your Facebook page and your Facebook, you, I'm, I'm, I'm looking on your Facebook page now. I, I see CEO of Together Trucking LLC. I see that, but I, I don't see none of your trucks. I don't see none of your, I don't see none of your, your trailers, your tractor trailers. I, I see you advertising for other trucking companies. And that picture right there, 
I don't even know if that's you. All right, so you only have one picture. I don't know if this is your personal page. Usually personal pages have more pictures. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So listen here, Ari Ariana O'Fearson. All right. Listen. I I'm I'm not trying to I'm not trying to bash you. I'm not trying to I'm not trying to say, you know, I'm not trying to uh dish you or anything like that, but you don't have no information that 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 I can't find. And if I can't find information on you, it just makes it suspect. That's all. That's all. I mean, uh, it, it it is what it is, I guess. I guess. Uh, yeah, it is what it is. All right, y'all, that's going to do it for today's uh, topic, today's episode of the Lockout Men podcast show. Thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and hit that bell and that all button. And I will come back at you guys with another topic. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you hit that like on the way out the door. I'm just saying that like button is important. So make sure you hit it. Make sure, that, you know, it, You know, I'm, I'm just going to come back and talk about fucking YouTube again. But that's that's here nor there. That's for a later date. Anyway, guys, take it easy, and I'll come back at you with another one. Peace.